we're gathered here today back at Halifax. Uh, we're going to be doing 240 questions. We're going to be taking in turns to ask the questions. We're going to be asking 15 questions each. Uh, we're going to start straight away with me. I will introduce these people to you later on, but we're going to crack on the first uh, 30 questions. So, good luck everybody. Uh, uh, it, the first question is... Kid. Oh. <laughs> Reset. Reset. Sorry about that. Good luck and good luck for the reset, season, everybody. The reset, reset the whole lot. Yeah, reset the whole lot. Thank you. That's the director over there, Mark. Number one. Literature, films, TV and games. More specifically, Oliver Twist, Toy Stories 2 and 3, Jim Bowen and Dad. Rose. Bullseye is correct. You get the first point of... Give him a little round of applause for the first point of... I'll put the points back on. Unlike the last time, I'm going to have to reset manually. Florentine, Gigli, Surprese and Farfa... Tony. Spinach. No, I'm afraid it's a point away is that one. Uh, Farfa... And Farfell, sorry, Debs. Types of pasta. Pasta is what I was looking for, even if I didn't pronounce it quite that. Debs, you are in the joint lead in the light speed quiz. Joint oh, lead off the <laughs> <laughs> What age was described in January 2016 as the new Lees? <laughs> <coughs> Go and tell them what you were going to say on that one. 69 is the correct answer. The new 27. Yeah. 69 is the new 27 after the deaths of Alan Rickman and David Bowie at that age. Well done, uh, Mike. Make sure you get your points on the board behind you. You are responsible. What has Hazel Jones of High Wycombe got four times more of than the average human? Laycock. Hair. Not hair. Child. Taste Elliot. Toes. Lees. Uh, teeth. Chris. Fingers. <laughs> Sam. Children. Michael. Kidneys. No. Nope. Ashton. Uterus. Thumb? Uterus. Woo. No. <laughs> Tony. Blood cells. Debs. Breasts. Rose. Rips. Preston. Uh, female parts. <laughs> female parts, vaginas. Yes, yeah, she's got two what, vaginas. She's what, got two vaginas. She's she's like to say four three. times the national average, because blokes haven't got one. That's not so so, 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 so uh, there was a spawning one for you there, if you don't mind me saying that. Well, I know he's someone like that. Clive, where are you? I can't see you. Preston. I'm here, hello. Two points. Thank you. Two points. <laughs> Numerically, which Super Bowl will be played in Daniel? 50 is correct. Uh, there you go, a gimme for you, Daniel. Right at the bottom there. What's it like being in the joint lead, Daniel? It's a 50 in two weeks. The red bad atmosphere. The White House Social Club. That's the White House Social Club is about 12 kilometres due west of the North Sea. In which town that sits Less than five kilometres from both the Tyne and the Weir. Chris. South Shields. Not South Shields, Lake Up. Stockton. Ashton. Washington. How did you know that was coming? Washington. Of course it's Washington. So, I'm just going to find out where you are. That's Ashton, isn't it? Well, it's all tight at the top. <laughs> In Greek mythology, what was the Greek spirit of forgetfulness and oblivion? Also the name of the underworld river, Steve Rhodes. Lefty. Out on your own on four points. <coughs> Richard Claderman would be associated with Ashton. He's correct. <laughs> Take no prisoners. Mark Laycock, how far you would be behind? Not much. What, who is the only, definitely, unmarried person in Cluedo? Ashton and Deb, you were both together because you whispered after the person next to you. Go on. Uh, 
Go on. Miss Scala. Miss Scala is a point. Deb? Yeah. That's a point. So well done. Yeah. Uh, very close to the rest of you as well. Uh, Ashton, plus one. Deb, plus one. Which element's atomic number is eight more than the wedding anniversary it commemorates? Rose. Oh, yes. huh? Go. A five, I'm afraid. Laycock. Tin. Tin. Not tin, that's the 14th Three. part. Debs. Oh, I was going to say tin. Oh. Michael. Silver. Ashton. Um, lead. Sam. Plasma. Well done, Sam. Oh, 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 oh. The platinum sits on 78 and the anniversary is 70, I believe, so Sam. Welcome to Light Speeds, whenever it is this year, Sam. Nice pressures and no, nobody, nobody got Dr. Point there. Only Tommy's lost the point so far. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be losing more in a minute. Who so scored? <laughs> Tony, you'll like this one, I can guarantee it. Who scored 26 goals for England during 90 appearances between 1980 and 1991? Chris! Minus one, Chris. Loser! Uh, Michael. Brian Robson. Brian Robson is correct. Do you want to finish the question up while I give you a mark? I got it from Antonio like this. <laughs> yeah, well, there you go. Yeah, it, I did, it, I did it, but it's a Between Stanmore and Stratford, during the third busiest and the newest, which London oh, yeah. Ashton? Jubilee. Jubilee line is great. Answer Ashton, I'm predicting great things for you. Look at the score. Mounting up. Tough to get points and you've got seven of them. Number 12, uh, number 13, sorry. The British Empire Strikes Back and reporting for duty, Tony. Falklands. Unlucky, man. It's a point, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> the British Empire Strikes Back and reporting for du duty, February the 5th, a tagline for which 2016 remake of Lake Up? Dad's arm is correct, Mark, obviously it was. Yes, on the board! On the board! <laughs> Two to go. Nominally, which river is the city of Hull upon? Rose. Hull. Correct. Good spot! <laughs> look at the smug look on his face with that one. It's only a You know, six points and snappy bag. Last one of my set. Uh, from the mid 14th century to the start of the English Reformation, what was a popular derogatory nickname given to those without an academic background, educated, if at all, only in English, who were reputed to follow the teachings of John Wycliffe? Tony! Oh, yeah. oh, you're back on neutral scores. We're going to go straight on with uh, Steve, your round, please. Good luck, everybody. Are all cameras look like they've got a little fresh flashing light on? They are. Yeah. This is Mr. Steve Drax Childs. Okay, question one. Oh, printed it that small, can't I read it? Right, here we go. Which famous award was designed by Cedric Gibbons? Oh, yes. It's Tony. Uh, the Academy Award Oscar. Correct. Yeah. I had my finger on, <laughs> finger on the mouse! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> right. Question two. What was the Monty Python's team's first movie, essentially? Lake Up. It was um, Rolling Road. No. Essentially a longer version of the team. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Let's do Lake Up first. Oh, you swine. Where are you? Minus one. You swine. Uh, Tony! Yeah, and that was something completely different to you. Yes. yes. <laughs> uh, just wait one moment. Green light. Released in 1978, originally as a B side to Rivers of Babylon. <laughs> Tony! Brown Girl in the Ring. Correct. You bastard! Hey Tony, you've come back into the game a little bit. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll get plenty more. Ones Green light. Plenty more minuses. Question four. Ceres was the Latin name for which country? Tony. Like I said. Okay. Plenty of Ceres. Syria. No. Oh, it's okay. It's the end of question. End of question. Yes. Rose. 
Ethiopia? No. Leaves? Cyprus? No. Kid? Uh, Greece? No. Chris? Algeria? No. Aston? Um, Morocco. Dead? No. China? Correct. Well done. Ooh, good two points. Green light. Question five. Can you give the occupation of Dad's Army character to Private Charles Godfrey before? Preston! He was, uh, he worked in the Army Navy stores. He was a shop assistant. Kind Correct. Of Two points. Go. Question six. The Madness song The Prince was a tribute to? Prince Buster. Correct. Question seven. Hang on, well, sorry, I've given Tony two extra points there, which I That's all right. It's okay. <laughs> and there, that's mine. Go. Question seven. Which form of London street is synonymous with low quality writing? Pass. You can't drink. Pass. Oh, me? Yeah. yeah. Search street? Nope. <laughs> it is actually. I'll give you that two points. Uh, Chris? Uh, Whitechapel Road. Nope. Tony? Grub Street. Correct. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Go. Question eight. Who was George W. Bush's vice president from two Michael Cheney. Yes. Yeah. Question nine. British actor Andrew Lincoln stars in which Mike Lee sorry. Walking Dead. Correct. <laughs> what did he say? Walking Dead. Walking, Walking Dead. dead. Yes. I knew you Question ten. What is the minimum age at which a person can stand as President of the United States? Michael. 35. Oh, Lee, what were you going to say? 35 as well. Got a point each. Are you okay with that, Michael? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's just a Matt Wolves first in the buzzer there. Uh, they were both equal on 424. So uh, who else gets one, Lee's? Yeah. Go. Question 11. Which sea is the least salty? Oh, yes. Kid. Uh, the Mediterranean? No. Tony? Baltic. Correct. Oh, I lose a point there, I think. Yeah. Question 12. Aqua Sulis was a Latin... Ashton. <laughs> what? <laughs> Correct. Go. Question 13. Who wrote the oratorio Echi Cor Meum? Handle. No. Skip. Leave. No. Let go. No. Chris. Three. No. Michael. Back. No. Ashton. Biden. Biden. No. Tony. Mendelssohn. No. Preston. Montreal. No. Sam. Look. No. Rhodes. Strauss. No. Elliot. Who's like it? Wagner. No. <laughs> go on. Paul McCartney. Okay then. Uh, question fourteen. Gervais Brook Hamster is the winner. Lake of is um Footlight College team on University Challenge. No. Uh, okay, man. So, no, yes, there is somebody else. There's Michael. Upper cost for the uh... Correct. Oh, oh, well oh. Right, so that's minus one for my man. Oh. And we've got plus two for Michael. Question 15. Hang on. Go. Question 15. Lee Marvin won the best actor. Cat Blue. Correct. Woo -hoo. That's the end of that round. Okay, we'll put a break on that, I think. Well done, everybody.